Are you managing multiple WordPress sites and having a hard time remembering logins and addresses to get into each one of these sites? Well, in today's video, we're gonna show you how to simplify that process and give you the grand tour of Manage WP. All right, so we're here, managewp.com. Um, and it says their tagline, a better way to manage WordPress. And I agree with it. You know, they've, they've got a dashboard that's built where you can integrate client reports, statuses on the website itself. You can do backups. There's a whole lot going on here. and We'll get into some of the details. But basically, this is a hub where you can integrate each of your different WordPress installations. And you can use this as a place to update, a place to monitor, and a place to a single point where you can go in, log into Manage WP, and immediately jump into the admin of your websites. So everything you need to automate workflows. You can maintain sites with daily tasks. You can set security and make sure everything's going well. You can monitor plugins, analytics, uptimes. You can collaborate because you can also bring people into your dashboard, give them access to where they can get in the sites. You can do client care and just optimizing sites. So there's a ton here. You know, you've got the testimonials, we've got the customer stories, and all that's cool. We'll jump into features real quick so we can walk through each one of those. This will give you a quick idea of what the um, of what the back end looks like. But you've got one click admin access into your website. So you can put as many sites as you want. And the beauty behind it is that to set up an account, it is absolutely free. It's a no-brainer, right? You only pay if you wanna get some of the premium features that they have, whether it's daily backups or advanced reporting and things like that. And we'll kinda of get into some of those things here in a bit. But you can do cloud backups. There's backups, cloning migration, security checks, performance checks, analytics. They even have white label where you can do, you can actually rebrand the back end of it and it's just really, really unbelievable. It's good, simple stuff and it works well. Plus there's security. So you've got one-click logins, but you've also got two-factor authentication. You can manage plugins and themes, ignore them. You can bulk install, you can update them, you can deactivate, you can do all kinds of things, right? And the collaboration. So they're, they're trans, <laughs> let's go into, let's go into pricing. They do have transparent price and they kind of tell you right up, it's free to get into the platform. And then they have what they call add-ons. So, you know, you've got free add-ons where you can do monthly backups and update, manage themes and plugins. And then you've got some premium ones and the premiums are like, it's two bucks. If you want to do daily backups on a website. Um, a dollar for white label, which white label is more in tune with the reporting where you can put your own branding on the reporting and it kind of eliminates Manage WP from the equation, makes it look a whole lot more professional. But that's that's kind of it, you know, that's the that's the rundown of it on the site, but we'll jump into the actual the actual uh, dashboard and it's cool. You know, here, here you go, like we've got our site here. You can jump in, go to the individual sites dashboard and you can see everything here, right? the different plugins that are on the site. You can see which ones you've got here. Look at the last backups, which I don't I don't back up my site through here. I don't have any other premium set up for my particular website, but you can do, you know, spam monetization or <laughs> monitoring and you can do SEO analysis and a lot of different things from the back end here. Um, you've got the options all on the left for what you can accomplish with the site. You can turn on backups it'll tell you you know which theme you're using how many plugins how many posts you can come in here and actually download copies of your site if you've got the premium you can clone this to another site that you've got set up so this is where that migration comes in set up backups on one site set up backups on the other and you can clone sites back and forth so it's it's super uh, super easy to use uh, a great interface to do it and you can also if you have a downloaded zip file you can restore from zip here it's it's just super easy you know you go under settings and all you got to do is drag and if you go to weekly it's going to add the price it'll tell you a buck 60 here a buck 60 here you know if you go up to every 12 hours it's two dollars 240 and then 480 if you want every hour um, i have backups turned off for this site only inside of managed wp it's handled by the host so i don't have to worry about it being done here but you can go down the plugins and see all the plugins that are here. You can activate, deactivate. You can do all that stuff from inside of this dashboard. You can go under here, check out the themes and see what's what. You can add additional users from here. That's <laughs> just pretty cool. 
you've got link monitoring and you know you can find out more you can hit learn more it's going to bring you back into what it all is what is actually included in link monitoring so they do a nice job all their support is uh, is really well done all of the, uh, the the services that they offer it's very clear what you're going to get from it you can run security checks you've got the performance checks uh, this is like it's not accurate anyway. This is off of a very, very old. Actually, you know what? Let's check it just to just for the fun of it. Because I haven't done it here in a while, and I kind of want to show you the real. Usually, doesn't take uh, incredibly long. So you can see we've started the performance scan. It's scanning uh, our website. We'll see. I don't look at optimization of it too much because I just go to the page, and if it loads quick, I'm good. Um, I don't care too much about scores. Scores don't necessarily always translate into real world performance. So um, you can end up chasing and spending a whole bunch of time trying to get the perfect score on, uh, you know, Pingdom or, or GT Metrics or any of those things, even Google page, sc uh, page scores. And sometimes you're chasing a ghost. If people go to your site and it loads quick, it's good, right? So yeah, so that's okay. You know, got this page load speeds down. Um, I got an F in JavaScript. That's okay. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. <clears throat> I know when I go to my site, and look, we'll go, we'll go. Just because. I don't find that that is very long for a site to get up running. You realize that you're here and, and get to go. And so I feel good about that. No one's complained. I'm feeling pretty solid. So moving on, we've got uptime monitors where you can get email, Slack, or SMS notification if your site does go down. That's huge depending on which clients you have and you can structure you know, how you pay or how much they pay you um, depending on these services. So if you wanna do a monthly maintenance plan, you can say, what do you need? You know, Do you want uptime monitoring? Do you need white label reporting? Do you need reports? All of these different things. How frequently do you need backups? Figure out what it's going to cost you and manage WP, have them right here, and then charge them accordingly based on how much it's going to cost you. It's an easy way to do business, and everything is held in one dashboard. We've got SEO rankings, so it'll monitor that as well for you. And then the client reporting. The client reporting is pretty cool. Um, it's simple. It works. And it gives you an idea of your site. So, you know, you can go through here, check out backups. They're up and running. You've got all the lack the backups you've got analytics here yeah so everything is everything is pretty good right you got this really nice pdf file that can be emailed out to your client you really don't even have to mess with it and then we've got white label where you can make it your own make wp or manage wp your own and this is really cool for all your reporting your client support all that stuff can be done right through here so it's a phenomenal platform i really just wanted to walk you through it because this is the way you can manage your business and scale your website development business using this platform and be able to offer a ton of different features a ton of different services to your clients that you might not have been able to do easily otherwise this allows you to scale that and do it very very quick and pain free so I hope that you've enjoyed this walkthrough of Manage WP. I really hope that if you haven't checked the product out, that you'll go out there, sign up for it. It's free. And you feel free to leave comments below on your experience with Manage WP. We'll see you in the next video.